Syracuse's offense was as cold as the ice and the temperatures outside on Friday as they fell 3-0 to Mercyhurst. Now, nothing seemed to go right for the Orange. They struggled to put pucks on net, and they even gave up a shorthanded goal on the power play. We tried to, to uh, work on it as, as the game was evolving tonight to, to manage the puck. I thought they were stacking the blue line pretty well on us, and they weren't giving us that lead pass, that head man pass. And, trying to force passes and whether it was power play or five on five, we got to make their D retreat. Obviously we didn't want to kind of take a tough loss there, but uh, overall I'm hoping that we can come back tomorrow with, with a big win. Uh, we had some great saves going both ways. I mean, they really played a great game as well. So I think it was a great game on both sides. Uh, just didn't come out with what we wanted. I mean, I believe we're t all tied now as Penn State and their seniors. Um, at the moment, so you know, to get that extra. <laughs> Now following tonight's result, Mercyhurst now moves into first place in the CHA with Penn State in second and SU in third. SU and Mercyhurst will be back here Saturday. Same opponent, same place, earlier start, 3 p.m. Reporting from Tennessee Ice Pavilion, Chile Casia Dele, Citrus TV.